<laughs> so what you say too early for life, but you over here. Mama read. <laughs> well, first things first, I want to say good morning to everybody. Sorry. Come on, stop using the word there. Grand rising to everybody. Now, if you wake up today and you're still in the physical realm, because you know you have many different realms, right? A spirit realm, you have physical realm, and then you have 5D realm. See? If you're still here in the physical realm with us, we have to give thanks. See? And um, I just feel the urge today, right now at this moment, for wake up and say, make we all give thanks. If you if you if you live somewhere right now, you're inside. You have warm clothes and you have food for consume. You have to give thanks. Whether it's a one room. Whether if a tenor owner share on one room, if it's a two bedroom, if it's a five bedroom, if it's a big house, if it's a if you're living in a shelter, it no matter. Cause sometimes people tend to make other people feel small. Yo, listen to me. Me could even imagine being homeless. Worse in them weather condition. So we have to stop and reflect on our blessings and consider how blessed we are to actually have food and clothing. You know what I mean? Like, at this psychological moment, if you don't have no all of money in your account, it don't even matter. You see, the, the fact of the matter say how nature and whether whether artificial whether are god made whether to oh, outside or go on you have to give the almighty thanks and you have to just say thank you almighty creator because it could have worse but the inside i may still feel cool me have to draw for the comfort and you know me i say so just picture somebody who has nowhere to sleep but under a bus stop. Picture somebody who has nowhere to sleep but upon a shopping mall or you know, a care park. Because the homelessness even in America is ridiculous, you know. Remember me going to some parking lot and see people are beard. Out a buckle, you know. Buckle water, them I use a beard, you know. You know, if them catch water from pipe in it or what. And every clothes and everything in them care, you know. So, me, I say, sometimes we are moved so fast in our life and we just enjoy our element and our moment. We don't even realize how oh, blessed we are. If you have something as simple as roof over your head, you know. Right now, if you can't buy, you see how some people complain about, oh, um, Cheesecake Factory. If you have a cup soup alone right now, you have to give thanks. And remember, I tell you, it's going to get worse. So you see, if you want to learn, if you appreciate and give thanks for what we have right now, even if you look at one cup soup where you might can at up and consume, you have to give thanks to that here. Yeah, if I'm gonna look at porridge, you can boil. You have to give thanks for that here. I have to give thanks for that. May I tell you, the way the way that I move now, it make me fall back, and I think in my brain I say, "Bomba cloud, look how God love me, look how the Almighty love me." 
Because, yo, I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this to a lot of the females, them. And the reason why I address it to females is because this mostly occur. <sighs> This mostly occur with females opposing to man. Zin? Ladies, don't make no ego right now. Make your throat your man out of the house. Worse in a weather like this. Sometimes I know I'm tired of the man. I don't know why I move on. And can remember say everybody have two set of thoughts in a day, you The God living here and devil living here. So sometimes the devil like I tell us, say, hey, mama, I want you. I know you have to chew him up. And you don't do it, you hear me? And you don't do it, you see me? Don't do it. And you hold it. And the man them when when you live in a woman place, sometimes you feel humble to that. You see me I say? Humble to brother. Cause my uncle can't imagine a woman I'll chew out on her own now in a them with her brother. It's not normal, brother. I not normal something. It's not normal. Me in my house. In my place. I me cover up and everything. I me still feel like a chill in here. Kelly RM. See the fan lock off. Everything lock off. AC lock off. Can't turn on them there. The way that chip. You understand? Yeah, Paul Dennis, we don't live with woman. Woman have to live with me, but at the same time, I say everybody's circumstances is not the same. I remember one time, me I got Jamaica, me I got Jamaica, and me, me I got JFK. And when me reach a airport, I see my bridge outside that smoke a cigarette. Zin, but even I want a polo shirt. That time I have a sweater plus jacket. Place cool like fridge. And I see my smoke and him have a polo shirt. So I know something wrong. For me see him in a polo shirt. So when I come out of the car and take out my suitcase, I say, Wow, go on my jeep. And he act like everything normal. And I say to him, say, Wow, go on with you. You alright? And him say, I just there, I go and hold it, man. You know, I say thing go with a tough it out. For him said that I know say something wrong. So my come in out I call out this. Uh, I say, I smoke. I say, oh, the cigarette and fall. I smoke the cigarette and fall. And I say, I want to go out with the animal. I say, John, no foot that. You know, so the girl put me out from last night and go me and go back to Jamaica, dog. And you know, I didn't have, have a jacket. The man never had a ticket, nah, nothing. Yeah. But I out of the airport, he was then. Remember, I said to me, I go and I have to take out my jacket and give me, you know, and give my thing in the pocket, you know. And I say, who oh, you can't call? And I say, I can't call nobody. The only person you can't call, uh, uh, um, uh, somebody of a VP records, where you must see that look work over there and really. I say, yeah, man, see something, if anything, and you get them. And you know, so the man, nobody got Jamaica and him there and him good now, and, so I thought him think about me, I tell you. Sometimes rough. Sometimes rough be. Sometimes rough. I mean, I tell you without the weather going there now be. I couldn't imagine being homeless right now. No, sir. Mm -mm. I can't imagine it, man. I can't imagine it, man. So I beg you, people just. Look into our own situation and know, say, we're blessed. We now have to have 10 hours and we now have to have 10 care. We now have to have rose rice and beans and beaver and, you know, 
just the mere fuck say you're alive one you have a roof over your head and you have food for consume no matter how small it is no matter how cheap the food is we want to reflect on that today and if you can help somebody in at these times help them See? Me a big one. Me a big one. If I can help somebody, help them. If you can give somebody even a weak rest in a basement or something so them can have shelter or do it. When they do it, I tell you, it's not easy. It not easy. It not easy. It's not easy. It not easy. Rent gone through the roof. Enough people are not what list them what listen up. Put the, the recession and the rent raise. Some people rent gone up by five hundred dollar. Some people rent gone up by seven hundred dollar. Some people rent gone up by three hundred dollar. You know it is difficult to pay the rent already. I know them other than to it. Come on, I beg on the people. If you can't help somebody, help them and help them from your heart. And nobody help them and then you hype on them and I make them uncomfortable in the house. And you know me, I say, help them, man. And even wait till the weather change. You tell them to them I feel good, but. No throw them out right now. Don't throw them out right now. Casey Chin may understand. It happened to me too. But me I say. In other time you with a weather yeah? No, sir. Can't throw out nobody now. And if you can help somebody help them. If you have an extra space, you can put a blow up bed and make them sleep. You understand me, I say? Well, before you help nobody, pray. And beg God for make you help the right person. Because you're not right, you can't trust people for you. Because sometimes you're letting people in your house, in your domain, in your space, them end up becoming your worst enemy. You see me, I say? So, I beg on you, please. Me just, me just did feel the urge to come forward and say that to you today. You understand what I say? I don't know the reason why, but to me, no, me feel cool in here. And I my own a place me in here. I mean, the comfort of everything. I still feel cool. Like, how I go ahead. Remember, say, Florida, I suppose it's so cool. You see me, I say? So please, people, give a helping on it when you can. You know, give somebody look a shelter if you can. Give somebody look a food if you can. Give somebody two blanket if you can. You know what I say? Like, even if you don't want them in your house, you can put them in a garage. You know, if you have no stable, we you keep animal and you have to keep the animal warm, you can them stay in there, you know what I say? Like it's rough, man, it's rough. It's rough, man. The amount of homeless people, my sister. No, like, yo. Me, 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 I worry about the homeless people, them right there. Swear. Swear, my mother's soul. 
Me a fruit upon the homeless people, and rich. No, nah, like Cha Cha. People have a nice day here. Yeah? I got go out warm up myself and calm up myself. You see me? But now they're gonna play it. You see me? The weather here yeah? and homelessness not go together. And ladies, me beg you again. Please, not make vexation and ego me gonna chew out nobody's son in them time. Members say when I have pity to on them something, you understand? When I don't know the future I go, I go bring. You see me? Don't choke nobody's son at this time. And rude boy, if you live with that woman and know you're living at the woman's place, and you don't have no rent, you don't have pay no bills, not, not to go and humble yourself. I nah say if you go eat no crutches. I nah say if you go dig our bottom. But me I tell you, if you live in the woman house, you are not nah pay no bills, you are nah not have no money like that. Humble yourself. Lower your voice. Strengthen up your back. You have to go do extra fucking you have to go make sure you fuck her good. And if she have her friend, they may want to fuck you. You have to go fuck them to all if you don't like it. Because you don't stable enough to go up on your own. You understand me, I say? So I beg on the road, boy. Humble on yourself. Humble on yourself. No matter how tough on your now, no way to go. Do not act tough and you not know if you go. I understand you not have no money and you not know if you go. Don't make the woman have to put you out in them where they are. Humble yourself. You me not say everything I feel going perfect in the house, but you not have nothing at all I go for you. Humble yourself. Hold your hand, double your fist and hold it. If she lock off the TV, don't turn it on back. You hear that? Yeah. If she says she don't want to smoke in her house, don't smoke. If she don't want to talk too loud by your phone, hang up your phone. Tell the road boy, no one has time for she throw you out, my lad. Hold it. When them where they are going, woman extra miserable, you know. Cause then why you forget problem, you know. Then why you feel say something, you know. Then why you feel say something. That's them opening the door. I say leave. For me call the police. But I make that go on humble road, boy. You then they are not paying the bills, you make sure you say. Even before mama reach home from work, two banana boil with piece of yam, and one couple dumplings knead up. You understand? You curry some chicken, or you brown stew some chicken if that's not there. You cut up some seasoning with the whole pepper, pepper, and like a thin mackerel, and make sure mama have something when she come home. Make she say she not want it. You know about the hype up yourself. You hear that? No, but I hype up yourself. And when mama come home tired, you know, consider it. You know, you know, make little food that mama can't get. Then when mama come in here, tell, oh, my hungry, I want to your girl. No, you would. Oh, Lord. You understand what I say? Oh, Lord, you would, boy, I tell you. 
Dance our gorilla, what go on? What do you think when I say that, brother? Um, no. Yeah, we have to understand the rude boy, the situation. I mean, I want, see, no, 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 out there, in a no cool bridge in homeless on them, dog. Homelessness wicked, you know, dog. I see it, you know. All right. For me, the America, I first miss so much homeless people in my life, you know. From I have been in America, it's the first. Me see so much homeless people. So I go up on Atlantic Avenue, that's so. Run a Walmart, where them have the, the Burger King and the McDonald's in a place. Yo, you know, I see homeless people around there, so. I leave out of them care, me. I say, bumbo clad. Up at them nice part of foot ladder deal, yeah. Well, it's a pump on the beach anyway. I still foot ladder deal. Fuck it. Me, up at them nice part. So much homeless people. No, be. Mm -mm. I don't know where the barber shop is. I mean, never see so much homeless people yet. Never see so much homeless people yet. And with that weather, yeah? No, sir. I couldn't imagine being homeless right now. I tell you. I have to just thank the Almighty Creator, say, me in a more one place and me have food in my fridge and food in my pantry, that's so. And, yeah, me have a light and me have, yeah, I don't know. Thank you, Almighty Creator. May I have care, can't jive me. Yeah. Thank you, Almighty Creator. Thank God that I'm picking them now homeless. Yeah. Thank you, Almighty Creator. People rough out there, hear that? People rough out there, hear that? People rough out there, hear that? I'm a strong up here and get yeah, help in anything I can get, you see me? I'm a blessed. Look, come on. 